up, everybody? Another day in art. Okay, guys, I am back. Let's try to finish this thing up. Hopefully, I got enough materials. Can't believe I ran out. Well, I ran out because I uh, forgot to widen this stupid thing. Okay, try this now. Hopefully, I don't screw up. Okay, and I want to put the ladder there. Voila. I'll have to put some windows in this too later once I'm uh, able to make um, glass. Oh, stupid thing. Put it on the wrong side, but well, I can still get up. I'll have to fix that later now too. Okay. Shoot, I got two two ceilings going over the wrong way. Darn it. Oh well, I can fix that later as well. Try to get this thing completed. I don't know if I have enough walls or not. I'm gonna be probably close. Some downstairs. Probably gonna have to make a little bit more walls. Probably gonna be just short. Gonna be pretty close though, pretty close. Okay. Okay. short. So I need one, two, three, four. Need four more walls. Uh, one thing, guys, I was going to tell you, um, if you don't have a metal pick, you can't, you know, get metal out of, uh, you know, the gold rocks. So before you get a metal pick, what you can do is just come down to these smooth rocks. I'll try to use use this one um, see these smooth rocks you can actually get metal out of these you don't get a whole lot but um, you will get some metal out of them not all the time um, but you'll get more metal out of these than you will uh, regular rocks so and these smooth ones are always around uh, water so say you already got two metal <clears throat> Like I said, you don't get it all the time, but you'll you'll get more metal out of these than you will uh, your big big uh, normal rocks. See that one here? I got two out of there. <clears throat> so something to remember before you get the metal pick. Um, you can get metal out of those smooth round rocks around the water. Um, like I said, I, well, I hit what four or five rocks, and I got five metal. So uh, something to remember. Because you, you'll get the metal out of that a lot quicker than you will um, just your regular big boulder rocks. So, uh, you can get quite a bit of metal pretty quick by using those. Alright. We have all of our walls up. Now, we've got to put our uh, roof on. See, I got. I'm gonna use a sloped roof, so I got to use these sloped sides. I should only need four. Um, uh, you know, what? I'm gonna need more um, walls too. Oop, yep. But I should be able to put. Boy, you really can't see that, can you? It goes on this one. Yeah, I'll need four more walls. Okay, 
But I should be able to finish the roof. Well, it's really hard to see these in daylight. Okay. All right. So, how many roofs I'll need? One, two, three, four, five. So I'll need ten. Ten roofs altogether, and then I'll probably need some flat ones, too. So I need, what, ten? And... Well, at least I got a couple flat, flat roofs. So I'll need those later. Do you want to put a fireplace in as well? Okay, let's go destroy this hut. So I need 10 sloped roofs out of this sucker. I don't know if I'm able to get it all out of there or not, but we shall see. I should get a decent amount out of the foundation. Tearing down the first, first structure on Rag Rock. So got my fireplace in there. Okay. Wow. Okay. Okay. Cool. It seems like it takes forever. All oh, the crap. <laughs> that one wall was holding everything up. Well, I sure didn't get a whole lot of stuff out of that. Oops. I thought I'd get a lot more stuff out of that than that. Okay, I want sloped. Like, only make one sloped out of all that? Jeez. That's horrible. Okay. this get the stuff out just got spark powder in there can they make any more well, so most likely I'm gonna have to go get some more thatch and stuff Interesting how that works. So I got f four out of that structure. That's it. See, they must not give you... Because I, I should have got some leather and I don't have any leather. Huh. Very interesting. Because the bed was made out of some leather. It didn't give me any leather. Leather. Okay, let's finish this thing. Hopefully we got enough materials now. Want to make a little nicer door. The stone door, the stone, the stone door is um, a lot nicer looking door, I think, guys. Um, it doesn't take a whole lot more materials than the wooden one. Um, you just need 20 stone, 8 thatch, and 14 wood. Where the other one, you need a little bit more wood. But uh, real easy to make. So I made one here. Put this bad boy on here. Maybe it won't let me. I thought you could put that on there. Huh. Well, never mind then. I swear you could put that on. Oh, you know what I gotta do. I gotta destroy this door first. Duh. Okay. Now she let me put it on there. There we go. See, it's a little nicer looking door, guys. I don't know why there's a gap right there. Okay, it looks a lot nicer, I think. Okay, I just I have to increase my weight. Which I can do, because look guys, I have seven... Seven levels I can level up. Okay. I'll do that, I'll do stamina. And I will do movement speed. And I'll do crafting skill. I oh, know I'll do melee. Bring my melee up. Okay. Okay, let's put this thatch roof on then. 
These things can be tricky. Okay, good. So sometimes these things can be really tricky. Getting them up on there. But once you get the first one, first couple, it's a lot easier. Okay. Sweet. We're gonna have enough. Should yeah, I have more than enough? Oh yeah. All right. We got plenty left over. Put some walls up. I got four walls. I should have made some straight thatch roofs. Okay. Fill in those gaps. So all I need is some flat thatch roof. So I need what? Two, four, six, eight. It looks like ten. Video I will have to show you guys what the fireplace looks like. Okay, I don't need to go in there. Since it ain't gonna ain't gonna happen today, it looks like. Okay, there it is, guys. There is my hum humongous house. Didn't need to make it this big. Depends what the fireplace looks like. Um, I might knock out some walls since this thing's humongous. So there it is, guys. <clears throat> See if I would take two. And that would have made it pretty small. But once I add some windows to this, it'll look a lot nicer. But that's my house for now. To me, it's a little too big, I think. But And I don't know if I can make it a more peaked roof or not. I probably could. So uh, maybe I'll work on that sometime to make it a completely, completely peaked roof. I think I know how to do it. But uh, yeah, that's it, guys, for today. Uh, my humongous house is complete. At least I'm a little more safer in here too as well. Um, since it's a little better than a fast route. I'll have to put a bed in here. I'll probably put the bed upstairs. Um, I'll work on the smithy in the next uh, video as well. So we can start making metal here. And maybe also we'll tame a pterodon or something. Or uh, a trike or something. And... Uh, help us with this the weight issue we have right now but yeah guys that's it there's my house all built they got to make some improvements and i'll put a, put a fence around it but yeah guys here's my humongous humongous house i'll have to start making crops too for narcotic berries okay guys here is the fireplace Come on. All right, I'm able to make the fireplace. Let's see, I want to stick it in the middle, as close as I can. So needs to go like right here. And there we got a fireplace to look like on the outside. Did it make it? It doesn't make it out. As you see, I improved the roof. Okay, so I am gonna make this uh, thing smaller so the fireplace is sticking out. And fireplace comes right there. So, so if I destroy. Looks like if I can destroy, um, just do a one. 
one wall. Because even if I would have stuck it on this wall, it still wouldn't have made it out. So it looks like I, I could take one ceiling down here. Or one wall down. Yeah. So I'll just make this. So I'll have to destroy all this. The roof and everything. Which is okay. So the the top floor will only be a be like an attic space. It'll, only, it'll be only a one one ceiling. So this can stick out. So got an idea what it's gonna look like. Ah, now it's raining. Ah, it's raining on me. Ah. So yeah, guys, I'm gonna have to do. You know, I'll have to do the peak roof and all that back over as well. So uh, I'll do that next episode, or uh, in between episodes. I don't want to bore you guys with it. But yeah, it looked pretty cool. So I only be three walls high. This house. Um, Look, probably looking nicer anyway, because it's kind of, to me, it's a little too big anyways. Um, but as you can see, I did get a peaked roof on here. But, uh, yep. Yeah. Next episode, you will see a smaller house, most likely. And it'll probably look a little nicer, look a little more natural, like a real house. So, uh, at least I got the fireplace in. Fireplace is cool because... It really warms up your house. No matter what type of house you have, how big it is, it um, it will. Oh, nasty storm out there, guys! Nasty storm out there. But yeah, it will warm up this house real quick. If you didn't see my uh, video on the island, um, go back and watch it. In the snowy northern region, if it was cold, um. I go back to my hut, turn the fireplace on, and this thing would warm up the whole place. And uh, you'd get warm real quick. So it's, the fireplace are great to have. If you don't have one, you need to get one and build one because it will heat up your whatever type of house space you have. And uh, it'll warm up real quick and uh, you don't have to worry about a bunch of fire fire pits or anything like that. You just All you need is one fireplace. So... Uh, that's why I had one to build one look cool for one, and then two, I wanted to build it because for the warmth factor as well. Especially since it gets cold up here where I'm at. But yeah, that's it guys. If I uh, like this video, please smash that like button. If you didn't like this video, d smash that dislike button. And please subscribe before you leave. Until next time, I will see ya.